Ladies and gentlemen, it is my most honor to introduce to you a rockabilly legend, a country music legend, a rock and roll legend, the Mr. Reconsider Me, Drift Away, Run Away, the one, the only from Malden, Missouri. Stand up and give your hand and your heart. I'm Narville Phelps, and we're at the Carolina First Center in Greenville, South Carolina. Well, in black clothes was the bad. You know what a real long time we had when we had. I don't rock up anyway. Well, I'm in the uh, Rockabilly Hall of Fame. I was one of the original Rockabillies and uh, first recorded for Sun Records back in the 50s, uh, which is the same label that launched Elvis and Johnny Cash. And, but I was brought to the attention of the label by Roy Orbison. Uh, I'd worked a show with him and Eddie Bond, and he went back and told them they should uh, give me a listen. And, uh, and so I wound up with an audition with them when I was 17 and first recorded when I was 18. But my greatest successes would uh, come in the 70s uh, in the country charts, and I did have the uh, Billboard and the Cashbox uh, country single of the year with We Consider Me. Well, Reconsider Me would be probably the most known. I had uh, a big, long hit streak in the 70s of a lot of uh, uh, The one that broke me through as a hit country artist was a country version of Drift Away. I had top 10 hits like When Your Good Love Was Mine, and I had the, the, the highest charting and longest charting version of Funny How Time Slips Away. Uh, Lonely Teardrops was a, a top five country hit for me uh, internationally. I made the Billboard country charts between uh, 73 and 87 uh, 50 times, uh, 42 times the uh, singles chart and 8 times in the albums chart. And I had made uh, the pop chart um, uh, about three times. Let me love you I live in Malden, Missouri, uh, which is a small town about 150 miles north of Memphis, about 200 miles south of St. Louis. I'm thankful that uh, music uh, uh, got me out of the cotton fields of, of southeast Missouri and uh, when I was pulling that nine-foot cotton sack and chopping cotton and stuff like that uh, and music rescued me back when I was 17 years old. Country is what I heard when I was a kid growing up. Uh, my mama would keep the radio, she would listen. Radio was all block programmed back then. There'd be two or three hours of country show and a two or three hour uh, pop show. And, uh, and so you heard a little bit of everything if the radio was on. But uh, back then we didn't have electricity and uh, there was a battery radio so they only turned the radio on and listened to the shows they wanted to hear. And so uh, it was the country shows, and I was here in Ernest Tubb and Floyd Tillman, uh, Hank Snow, and people like that. I can't make it without your love. Girl, can't you see? So please let me. Well, I'm honored to be a part of these uh, legends and memories uh, shows. What an honor to be a part of it and what a lineup they get. 
and with what uh, uh, J.D. Michaels and uh, uh, Sheila Miles are doing on the radio. Thank you, GreenvilleHD.com. Oh, thank you so much.